Former Prime Minister Imran Khan's abandoned freedom march or Azadi march is on the top court's radar. Pakistan Supreme Court has sought a report on the violations made by Imran Khan and his party members during last week's long march. Last week, Imran Khan had led a mega march from Peshawar to Islamabad. It was among the biggest rallies that Pakistan had seen in years. The march, as we are seeing, was of course marred by clashes as the police tried to deter the rally from entering Islamabad. The police had fired tear gas at protesters to disperse them. There were also reports of the PTI supporters throwing stones at the police officials. Simply put, absolute mayhem on the streets. The rally had gone ahead even as the authorities had invoked Section 144, which is a measure that is used to curb gatherings. And now, one week after the rally, members of a bench led by the Chief Justice of Pakistan have issued a written order. The order took note of the alleged involvement of the PTI leaders in these protests in instigating party workers to reach Islamabad's Dichok. The order stated that bona fide efforts made by the court were disrespected and that the move was in fact a violation of the Supreme Court's May 25th order. During the rally, hundreds and thousands of people flooded onto the national capital's red zone. The court has raised security-related questions like when, where and how did the crowd cross the barricade to enter a closed area? Was the crowd entering the red zone organized or was it supervised or did it move randomly? Another important question, were there any acts of provocation or breach of assurance by the government? The Supreme Court has sought the reports from the Director General's of the Inter-Services Intelligence, the Intelligence Bureau, the IG Islamabad, as well as the Interior Secretary. Meanwhile, Imran Khan and his team rejoiced at the court's order against the Interior Minister. A Sessions Court in Lahore has ordered the registration of a criminal case against Rana Sanaula as well as top police officials. The case pertains to the alleged torture of lawyers by authorities. On the day of the PTI's march in the capital, the order was issued after a lawyer petitioned the court. Last week, Imran Khan had posted a video of the alleged police brutality. He termed it, and I quote, condemnable and unacceptable. Khan had warned about seeking registration of cases against those responsible for using force against his party workers during this march. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.